In the Kirov region there is a small village of 50 houses. On the one side of the village is a small river, on the other a dense forest, which stretches for hundreds of kilometers. A little girl, Sveta, lived in this village, and she had her only friend, a German shepherd named Trujok, which means friend. Both the girl and the friend were six years old. They were born on the same day, and when Svetika was brought from the hospital, Uncle Pasha, the father's brother, brought a puppy as a gift to a young family. Inseparable friends, the villagers called them that. Where there is Svetika, there is also friend. Where there is friend, there also look for a girl. The trouble happened in that rainy summer, the girl disappeared. She did not return for dinner, and did not return for dinner. Friend on that day was put on a chain, since mom's sister came to visit from the city, and for some reason the dog didn't like her. Parents were busy guests and noticed that the girl disappeared only in the afternoon. They went around the whole village, nobody saw the girl. Only a grandmother of one 80-year-old seemed to see her in the morning near the forest, she was gathering strawberries. But was she or not? Grandma was not sure. Parents ran around the forest, searched near the river, Svetika was nowhere to be found. In the meantime, it became dark and it started to rain. The villagers began to gather at the girl's house. What to do, where to look for a girl? It is senseless to go to the forest at night, three lanterns for the whole village, and those non-working, batteries, sat down. We decided to start the search at dawn. Until the morning, the people went their separate ways, leaving their parents, who were beside themselves with grief and the dog who whined. As soon as it began to dawn, about 30 people gathered around the house. Everybody came, except old people and children. Someone said to unhook the dog, let him look for a friend, although it is useless. The rain has not stopped since yesterday evening. The dog freed from the chain rushed toward the forest and disappeared into the thicket. People were divided into groups. Part dispersed along the river. Young people diving examining the bottom. Another part, together with her parents, went to look in the forest. And the rain poured and poured. There were the fourth day of the disappearance of the girl. The ranks of search engines are noticeably smaller. Several people caught cold and lay with fever. Others received minor injuries during the search. In the courtyard of the empty house lay the friend, beside which lay a weakened Svetika, clasping the dog with both hands. Dirty shreds of a dress barely covered the small, scratched and bruised, fragile body. They were seen by that same 80-year-old woman passing by. The whole village immediately gathered, called an ambulance, and found parents in the forest. Svetika was taken to the hospital. Friend and remained lying in the middle of the yard. He was dead. The dog's eye was swollen from a viper bite. From the yard towards the forest stretched the trail on the damp ground. Friend is already on the verge of death of the last forces dragged his friend to the people. The last thing he saw was his friend's arm, swollen with insect bites. He tried to lick her, but he no longer had the strength. The dog died knowing that the girl would live now. People were shocked by the human deed of the dog. People were crying. The whole village cried. Have you ever seen the whole village crying? God forbid you see this. Friend was buried on the outskirts of the village near the birch. The girl's father put a huge boulder stone in the burial place of the dog. Svetika was more and more silent, now she was often seen next to her friend. There were a lot of flowers around the boulder. Now adult Svetlana Sergeevna arriving in her native land, first of all goes to her friend. She gently strokes the boulder and tells the friend news from her life. That was the real life story. No wonder they say that a dog is a man's best friend. And even more. The dog is not just a friend, it is a family member.
subscribe, like and write in the comments your opinion about this story. С вами был канал Притчи и рассказы. Всего вам доброго и до новых встреч!